Hi everyone, so today we're heading to MCM London Comic Con. Super excited for this video and I hope you enjoy it. First of all, we make our way there. So here is me, half in cosplay, on my way to the Excel Center where MCM is held, I think every year. So first of all, you have to do this super long walk just to get into the venue, but it's okay because we saw a pink sign, which makes it all better. Then we have the queue. This is my lovely cameraman for the day, Oscar. And then I collected my creator pass. <laughs> Oscar then went and got in a queue for some food whilst I got changed. Here I am, a Seraphine, look how cute. And then we ate some chicken. The food was actually really good and definitely helped me get through my day. And now we're just wandering around and we're gonna have a look and see what's in here. And then we'll get back to you and tell you what we've been up to. So as you can see, there is so much to do. We've got a PC gaming area. We had a Beat Saber area, which was super cool. Then there's the retro games part, which I never played and I wish I did, but next time for sure. So here I am checking out the stalls, but then I got recognized and they wanted pictures of me and they were both really sweet, really kind. First photos of MCM 2023. And then I got recognized again. But then after this, I continued to look around at the stalls and we found some pop vinyls. Now I have a big soft spot for pop vinyls. So I was checking those out. And then I came across one of my faves. No one ever knows who this is. <laughs> Snow White vibe. Up the top. There is a tangle vibe. It's hard to see what's ahead of me because the contacts make my vision really blurry, so I'm like this. What do you like the look of? Oh, I didn't even see this one. The pink one's cool. I'm just eyeing up. If I can buy one tomorrow for when I'm baby doll, because I have a samurai but it's metal, so I won't be allowed in with it. So I think I'm gonna buy one that they sell here tomorrow so I can get some cool baby doll photos. They're all so squishy. I want it. I want to eat it. I want to touch it. You won't touch the bike. My downfall is teddy bears, so this was dangerous. No, I don't know. <laughs> Bunnies are my favorite thing in the world. And there was a sparkly bunny, so Oscar bought it for me because he's so sweet. <laughs> One of my favorite things about checking out the stalls is that a lot of the art is original art from small artists themselves. So you are supporting small companies. Ah, amazing. Check out all this art, all this creativity that I'm about to show you, super, super cool. There's a costume shop, so if you didn't come in cosplay but you want to be dressed up now, you can still take part. We then found a cool photo opportunity of a pirate ship. Now, sadly, my costume didn't fit this theme, but it was still super cool. Then we bumped into a Dalek. He gave me a high five. <laughs> so cute. And then we bumped into loads of them. Look at him. Look at him. He can't take his eyes off of me. I. <laughs> eye off of me. Anyway, Oscar wanted to go meet a voice actor from the game God of War, so we did that. We popped him in the queue, and whilst he was waiting in the queue, I disappeared to go check out the venue. Again, more super cool photo opportunities. Look at me, hi. And then I bumped into another Seraphine. She was the only Seraphine I saw for the whole three days of con. Then I met up with Oscar, who was extremely happy. We thought about getting a snack, but we thought we'd save ourselves, so we headed outside. It was a lovely day, and I bumped into some familiar faces. <laughs> You're in the vlog, babe. Oh, hello. hello. <laughs> My lipstick looks really crusty. We started to get a bit hot, so we decided to finally treat ourselves to an ice cream, and it was so good. So today, I'm at... No, no, let me start again. I'm at MCM Comic Con with the beautiful and delightful Louise. Louise, Louise. Introduce yourself to... My own channel. To your own channel. Hi, everyone. I'm Louise. Today, I am Louise, and uh, this is Martin, who 
I've met on FaceTime, but the first time in person. Yeah. And he's rocking like the pinkish vibe, which I respect a lot. You know, pink to make the girls win. Oh, never heard that one. Uh, so I am I'm truly honoured. I think it, it matches Louise's um, hair, but, but naturally the outfit of today's award must go to Honestly, I wish I could show you more of this interview, but Martin can talk for England, so this will be a very, very long vlog. But it was lovely to meet him, and he brought some real entertainment to this video, and I'm happy for that. Now it's photo time. This is Nigel, or also known as Cosplay Academy UK, and we got some really lovely shots in the Yacht Hotel, which is just outside Excel. You can check out the photos over on my Instagram. And then I got stopped by 86 Floor. Now, I've never worked with them before. They're Europe's biggest cosplay channel to exist, and they were so nice and it was so much fun working with them. My fingers are crossed to see them at OctoberCon and hope that they want to collab with me again. Check it out. How cool was that? I love that video so much now. It's my favourite. So, hanging around the trees where a lot of photographers take photos of cosplays because the lighting's not too harsh. And then if not, you can just chill on the green, you know, really spacious, grab some air. Having some twirl moments, catching those rays. Look how sparkly I am. And then of course, other photographers wanted photos as well. I it's like a giant pink thing. I don't quite know what it is. And it was a little fool, guys, and he's pink. So we did a little dance, and then I thought it was nice to make new friends. So I started interviewing strangers. If you could be in any other cosplay, who would it be? Uh, probably Sailor Moon. Wednesday Adams. Hutao from Genshin Impact. Scarabus. Piori. Bowser. Oh, you baby dolphin. What do I tomorrow? Donna Noble. Loki. Do you know what? I would be Avatar. Princess Ariel. I'd be Seraphine. Jenny. Really? Then to end the day we returned back inside and this guy on a lightsaber stand let us use the lightsabers and I popped off. All the men behind the desk were cracking up because they wasn't expecting me to go off as hard as I did. I returned it really quickly because I felt myself getting a bit out of control and then we headed to the cloak room and then that was day one finished. Bye! Hello everyone, uh, this is not how I expected day two to start, it is currently half two in the afternoon and I am obviously not at con right now. Last night uh, I went to hospital um, with a lot of pain in the left side of my chest around my heart, saw a lot of doctors, had blood tests, x-rays, we was there till about half four in the morning had a lot of painkillers. The pain has become more bearable. I'm quite breathless. I don't feel right, but my plan is to go in hopes that it's going to help me mentally, which will take a bit of the anxiety and stress off. And the anxiety is definitely making my chest feel worse and tighter. So again, we started to make our way to the XL. Now I made sure to take it really chill, really easy. We was only there for about an hour because we got there at the end of the day, but I wanted to try and get some content. I bumped into 86 floor and they worked with me again. This video isn't up yet, so I can't share it, but once it's up, I'll let you know. And then I found Nigel. He waited around for me to make sure I got some photos because he knew I'd been in hospital all night. <laughs> It's going to explode. <laughs> we had a little catch up and then we started shooting. I really enjoyed this shoot. You should check out his Instagram. He is brilliant. The day was basically up, but I bumped into a friend and asked him a question for some fun content. Oh. The, my biggest fictional crush, uh, uh, well, human crush, <laughs> is uh, probably Wanda Maximoff. But if we're talking others, uh, Nala from The Lion King <laughs> is uh, absolutely gorgeous. Um. So with a short day in hand, that's all the aerial content I have for you. However, I do plan on coming back to MCM in October as more Disney princesses for some princess magic. But now rolling on strong for day three. So today is baby doll. I was feeling a bit better today. I was feeling very drowsy from all the medication I was on, but I was a tough cookie and I did it. Here's me eating some chips. Okay, so I'm trying to find a samurai sword. Uh, because I want to get one to use for my photos and videos today. I do have one at home, but it's metal and quite sharp and you're not allowed to bring sharp objects in. So we're on a hunt for a plastic one that looks pretty good. 
we found one yay i was really happy that i got this it was gonna make my pictures look that much better but obviously before going outside for photos i was being mobbed indoors people were recognizing me this young girl knew me and she was a big fan which was really sweet but eventually i made it outside for photos and of course, again, I met up with Nigel, who had some brilliant locations and ideas in mind for the baby doll aesthetic. Also, shout out to Cosplay Flame for the cool photos. Make sure you follow my Instagram for when the photos are posted. And that is a wrap. See you next con. Ha ha ha!